This is something. And you, you saw the you saw the picture there, right? Um, Santa equals Satan? Question <laughs> mark. Yeah. To Alex from Teddy, before opening requires listening to introductory poem of excessive length and questionable craft and literary quality by TLD. Okay, here it is. All questionable, right. questionable quality. Whoa! Oh my gosh, I broke it. No, I don't no? Okay. I, okay. I, I, I blame Santa. I blame, right, okay. Uh, okay, twas, uh, twas the morning after the night before Christmas. <laughs> or words to that effect. It's called The Spirit of Christmas, Chris Kringle or Asmodeus. What? <laughs> a post Mayan ap apocalypse doggerel for Alex, Chris Xmas 2012. Okay, okay doggerel. Wait, I have some Get doggerel the dogs already. The doggerel. Doggerel. No, nah, this doggerel is not really into Sit. it. Okay. All right. Sit down. Okay. And be... Oops. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. All right. I demand absolute silence <laughs> and worshipful attention. Okay. All right. The season is joyous, or so we are told, but mostly December just leaveth me cold. The shopping, the schlepping, the ersatz good wishes, the re-gifted fruitcake, two years past delicious. Oh, that's I'm, great. I'm off driven frantic by all of the above, and hear myself fervently crying, Enough! I'm loath to admit I'm a sour old geezer, but why is my Facebook ID... Ebenezer. <laughs> the carols, the carols hear blessing in each silver bell. So why does the Yuletide just put me through hell? Oh. The excess of Xmas is clearly one trigger, but also dark questions ray its central figure. <laughs> I speak not of Jesus, the babe born but newly, but that pudgy old putts down from Ultima Thule. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, yeah, uh, it gets worse. <laughs> Though seemingly merry and jolly and giving, is stealing of souls what he does for a living? Uh, is he really the father of lies and confusion who seeks to ensnare us in webs of delusion? Deep spiritual questions and well worth debating. That red suited gnome, is he Santa or, or Satan? Satan? For one, there's the name, just an anagram trick. No, they both use an A-K-A ending in Nick. Mm -hmm. One's a saint. One is old. Does that thicken the plot? Coincidence merely? I rather think not. <laughs> they both dwell far off where the weather is extreme. They both work with helpers as head of a team that some folks call demons and some folks call elves. A man might strike brimstone if too deep he delves. They both know your secrets, though naughty or nice. The punish and punishments given for each hidden vice. One leaves in your stocking a mean lump of coal, foreboding the burning of your wretched soul. Oh my God, this is great. Santa Claus. I'm starting to believe in it. Santa Claus, Père Noel or Prince of Hell. And both are sung in epic works from poets by the score. See Dante, Milton, Goethe, and dear old Clement Moore. Clement Moore. The one is known by witches, by bitches, and by hoes. The other is known for laughing with those phony ho ho hoes. <laughs> and gifts come from one's workshop for kids from many lands, and one is widely known for making work for idle hands. Yeah. Plus, one comes down the chimney, and one resides in flames. Does any doubt remain the dude has two near-matching names? As Santa, or as Satan, were all his willing thralls. To turn from him in either guise requires more than Christmas balls. <laughs> so yield ye to your waiting fate, O sinner and gift buyer, for Christmas like the pit of dooms and all-consuming fire. So, Mary... Hellish Christmas, which word best limbs its essence? Perhaps there's further evidence contained in this year's presence. But of avuncular best thoughts, there can be no denial. Glad tidings on this special day. Love, Teddy or Belial? Uh, yay! Uh, that was there you go. That's, That's your phone. Thank Teddy, you. Yes. The devilish, the devilish ho ho ho. Ah. Oh, oh, oh. Your bowl full of jelly. That's right.